Good morning, folks. Today is Monday, April 14th, 2024, and here's what's coming up this week in TAPS. We've got three state championships taking place this week. 1A and 2A golf are underway this morning. The 1A golfers are competing at the Squaw Valley Golf Course in Glen Rose, and the 2A championship is taking place at the Cottonwood Creek Golf Course in Waco. You can follow results live on the TAPS Golf app. We will have updated brackets on the TAPS website at the end of the day. The championships will finish up tomorrow. Follow at TAPS underscore golf on Twitter for more. Also getting started today... The 4A, 5A, and 6A state tennis championships are taking place at the Waco Regional Tennis Center in Waco, Texas. Those tournaments finish up tomorrow. The 1A, 2A, and 3A tournaments will take place on Wednesday and Thursday. Draws are posted to the TAPS website, so check back for updates. Follow at TAPS underscore tennis for news and results as we go through these tournaments. We will have a photographer in Waco on Tuesday and Wednesday, and you'll be able to find those images for free at taps.smugmug.com. Our third event this week finishes up our spring music events. The 2024 TAPS Orchestra State Championship takes place this Saturday at Brentwood Christian School in Austin. More details on the TAPS website. Speaking of fine arts, we had two state championships wrap up last week. It was a rainy two days in Waco for the 2024 TAPS State Art Championships. Schools competed across multiple categories with finished works from the previous year and also in two on-site drawing contests. You can find individual results on the TAPS website, but here are how the school results shook out. In 1A, the Westwood School of Dallas was your first place winner, followed by Jesus Chapel School of El Paso in second, Texelma Christian School of Sherman in third, and Waxahachie Preparatory Academy in fourth place. In 2A, Sacred Heart Catholic School of Hallettsville was your first place winner, followed by Abilene Christian School in second, Concordia High School of Pflugerville in third, and Covenant Christian School of Conroe in fourth place. In 3A, the Christian School at Castle Hills of San Antonio was your first place winner, Round Rock Christian Academy came in second, Lake Hill Prep School of Dallas came in third, and Holy Trinity Catholic School of Temple was your fourth place winner. In 4A Art, Geneva School of Bernie was your champion, followed by McKinney Christian Academy in second place. The Brook Hill School of Bullard was your third place winner, and Logos Preparatory Academy of Sugarland came in fourth. In 5A, Fort Bend Christian Academy of Sugarland was your first place winner. Liberty Christian School of Argyle came in second. Grapevine Faith Christian School took the third place spot, and Grace Community School of Tyler was your fourth place winner. And finally, in 6A, John Paul II High School of Plano was your state champion. Concordia Lutheran High School of Tomball, your runner-up. Nolan Catholic High School of Fort Worth came in third place. And Antonian College Preparatory High School of San Antonio came in fourth. More team results on the TAPS website. We've got photos from the two-day championship event in the works. You'll be able to find those at taps.smugmug.com when they are available. Also last week, the 2024 TAPS State Vocal Championships took place at Midway High School. Points earned here from the large ensemble performances combined with solo and small ensemble scores from earlier in the spring tell us which are the top vocal music programs in TAPS, and here are your results.
In 1A, Founders Christian School of Spring is your state champion, followed by First Baptist Academy of Universal City. Holy Cross Catholic Academy of Amarillo came in third, and Second Baptist University Model of Houston was your fourth place winner. In 2A Choir, Concordia High School of Pflugerville is your state champion, followed by Covenant Christian School of Conroe. Greenville Christian School came in third, and Allen Academy of Bryan was your fourth place winner. In 3A, Round Rock Christian Academy is your state champion. Temple Christian School of Fort Worth is your state runner-up, Rose Hill Christian School of Tomball came in third, and Brazos Christian School of Bryan took the fourth place spot. In 4A Choir, Lake Country Christian School of Fort Worth is your state champion, Geneva School of Bernie your state runner-up, Cypress Christian School of Houston took the third place spot, and Brentwood Christian School of Austin came in fourth. In 5A, Grace Community School of Tyler was your state champion, Southwest Christian School of Fort Worth came in second. Lutheran South Academy of Houston took the third place spot, and Midland Christian School came in fourth. And in 6A, Concordia Lutheran High School of Tomball is your state champion. And finally in 6A, Concordia Lutheran High School of Tomball, who you're hearing right now, is your state champion. got photos of the large mixed ensemble performances in the works, plus recordings of large ensemble performances going up today, along with recordings from the 2024 Spring Band Championships. You will be able to listen to and download all of that from our SoundCloud page, and I'll have a direct link for you in the show notes. Looking ahead to next week, academics, speech and debate, and regional track are all taking place. We have full details on the TAPS website, and you should always check the TAPS calendar for upcoming events. Just visit taps.biz and click on Calendar. That's it for This Week in TAPS. This Week in TAPS is a production of the Texas Association of Private Parochial Schools. It is produced and hosted by me, John Skees, the Director of Media for TAPS. Brian Bunzelmeyer is our Executive Director. Robert Huckabee is our Associate Director and Director of Compliance. Steve Prudhomme is our Associate Director. Steve Fuhulin is our Athletic Director. Rhonda Smith is our Director of Fine Arts. Liz Cornett is our General Manager of Corporate Partnerships. Kelly Bay, Delaney Bunselmeyer, Will Dixon, and Vicki Morgan help keep everything running smoothly in the TAPS office from transfer paperwork to event logistics to live broadcasts. Thank you for listening. We'll see you next week. <laughs>